UST political science professor Dennis Coronacion weighs in on the latest results of the Pulse Asia survey. Based on the survey, former Senator Bongbong Marcos Jr. still leads with 56% of the respondents choosing him. The 56% that Marcos got for the April edition is similar to what he got last March. According to Coronacion, the presence of Marcos Jr. in social media platforms after the 2016 elections brought him in the strong lead. Bumato lang ano eh, nung ito ma maagang preparasyon na, lalo na doon sa social media. Coronation adds the current lead of the uni team to their opponents may be hard to surpass. Medyo mahirap abulit yung survey numbers ni uh, BBM kasi mm -hmm. nananag dili ko sa 50 plus. The political analyst also clarifies that last Pulse Asia survey does not include the huge political rallies conducted by other candidates and also the shifting of support of some groups. It means the numbers could still change on election day. Marami din nakaka-capture yun eh. Like yung mga shifting political alignment sa ground level, hindi pa nakaka-capture. Nel Maribuho, UNTV News and Rescue, we serve the people, we give glory to God.